year 1898. Good morning, you are watching BAC and today we're going to talk about a recent arrest of a man after he returned to the United States from Honduras due to his crime of stealing while working at the bank. We will have Peter explain specifically. Uh, uh, thank you, Billy. William Sidney Porter, born in North Carolina, but then moved to Texas at age 20, where he held several odd jobs. And in 1896, he was accused of stealing. Then he fell to Honduras until he had heard the news of his wife's illness and he returned to Texas. And then he is now in cavity captivities after his wife passing. Back to you, Billy. Thank you, Peter. What a tragic life. Now we'll take a break and continue after a short advertisement. Red Bull, absolute power! <laughs> Year 1907. Audio Jungle. Welcome. Recently, there have been a really famous writer who worked for New York World and to everyone's surprise, he is William Sidney Porter and now also known as O. Henry who was, who was imprisoned and released just five years ago. Now, he has had many significant short stories which we will have our friend Peter who will help us with it. Indeed, I will. After his move to New York, he wrote one story a week from 1903 to 1906. During the time, there has been some popular works from notably is the story collection, The Four Million, which contains fan favorite like The Gift of Maggie, Magi, and One Thousand Dollars. Wow, wow, what a comeback. Oh, Peter and I won't be back as news reporter unless there's a war in the next five years, which I don't think will happen. Goodbye. Three years later. Breaking news! Oh, Henry, a beloved writer has recently passed away. Being known as an alcoholic, he died of uh, illness of the liver, complication of di diabetes, and a large heart. We will have Uyên to tell you about his later life. Thank you. During his later life, he had witnessed unhappy rematches and major financial problems, but our Henry had publishes all over 600 stars, sorry, during his lifetime and is considered the master of the genre and he will be remembered forever. What a memorable, memorable life. Now we'll go to our most important news. Look at this cat, what a piece of art. 